Good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. Hope you're all doing well. Today, I have a lot planned, actually. It's so warm. Like, it's so hot today. Well, for Northern Ireland, it is. It's like 21 degrees. I know in England, it's probably like 30 right now, but this is the hottest we get here, so I'm struggling. Um, and this morning, my mum had the heating on. What's that about? Like, I am sweating. So, I'm actually about to go out for lunch here. It's half ten, so I would say brunch maybe. Um, just with my friends, just to have a wee catch up and chill out. Um, and hopefully sit outside in the nice weather. Um, I absolutely hate August. Like, why do wasps have to just be so evil and horrible in August? Like, I hate them. Like, I literally hate them and they just come right for my face it's like they, they just know they just know i don't like them but yeah um i'm not gonna vlog like being out for lunch and stuff because i just want to enjoy it and like catch up and stuff so i'll just catch up these after but yeah just wanted to do a wee intro i'll show you actually what i'm wearing today please excuse the mess but this is one of my wee dresses from my jj's house haul so i absolutely love it i just think it's so flattering like my legs look like wee sticks in it but like it just it kind of does come quite low so I have put like a wee crop top under it just so that it doesn't like show my bra or anything and then it just kind of like overlaps here and of course I have my trusty cycling shorts on just in case it blows up and then I've got these shoes on from Pretty Little Thing these were actually sent to me from Chloe Sumner I will put her name up on the screen she's so lovely and another youtuber um but yeah she had a competition on and i won it i also won a pair of sunglasses but they're away in the other room these sunglasses are actually from shein or shein or whatever you call it um absolutely love them but yeah i'm gonna take a me soon there's just something i sit sitting outside in a nice day people watching with your friends talking rubbish that i absolutely love like it's just set my whole weekend off on a good note and i'm feeling good i am at a shopping center just i need to go in and get some bits for work and I actually need to pick a wee bit of makeup up and maybe pop into pre-mark for a wee nosy um got my face mask on because they're mandatory it clashes with my outfit so bad but one I've got on my I did have like a plain baby pink one but I don't really know what I've done with it I last had it um la on Monday I think I last had it uh, in Jamie's car and I think I might have left it there because I can't find it so I've got my red polka dot one and I'm ready to go I'm absolutely sweltered so I'm definitely gonna suffocate in this mask but it must be done um I will obviously I can't like talk you through it but if I go into pre-mark I'll like kind of like show you what's in um, just like a wee montage because obviously it's too muffly with a mask on. went into pre-mark for nosy and i've bought too much stuff there actually was like quite a lot i'm so out of breath from wearing the mask so warm um there actually was like quite a lot of stuff reduced and quite a lot of nice stuff so i picked up this big bag so a big bag from pre-mark and pineland which was unexpected as well and um, i also picked up some stuff from superdrug and sally so I will show you, sorry, I'm not very good at this. I will show you what um I got. So firstly I picked up some nail wipes for work from Sally's and some acetone for work from Sally's. Then in Super Drug I picked up some so I got this NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade London. I always see people raving about this and I've always wanted to try it but it's always sold out online. So when I've seen it in 
Superdrug. I was like, friggin' right, I'm lifting it. So that was six pounds. Um, then I picked up some of my trusty Fit Me foundation. Um, I couldn't remember what shade it was, so I just guessed. I lifted 104, which I think will be good for my days that I don't wear tan, which is quite a lot. So I just need this for like everyday wear. And then I picked up some of my good Maybelline Instant Age Eraser in shade Ivory because can't live without it and there's barely any left in mine. And yeah, that's it. I'm not going to show you what I got in Primark and Poundland because... I'm hoping to do a wee haul. Um, I'm going to sit down and see. I can't actually remember how much I bought in Poundland. I have a big bag there. But I don't know if it's interesting enough for a haul. So I might actually like include it in this. Maybe when I get home I'll sit down and show you. Um, but yeah. Look out for a pre-mark haul. Uh, it'll probably come out. So this will be out on Friday. This vlog. And then the pre-mark haul will probably be up on Sunday. So you'll only have two days to wait. Um, yeah. But I'm going to go home because I'm literally dying in this car. Like, it, it's so warm. Like, I can't, I can't do it. Okay, so I decided to sit down and show you what I got on Poundland. Please excuse the mess. All around here, there's wires everywhere. And all my stuff for my hauls this week is sitting on my chair. I really need to find out a new system. Like, everything is just everywhere at the minute. So I've got this big bag from Poundland. Full of rubbish. So I'm just going to... Um, show you what I picked up. First thing I noticed was this Fabulosa spray in watermelon. This smells divine. Like pure summer. Pure summer. Um, I cannot wait to use it. I haven't been able to get in like the NM or anything so if you're looking for it and can't get your hands on it, Poundland. They also have the rhubarb one but I've got everything else in rhubarb so I wanted to try the watermelon and it's so nice. Then I picked up some of these hairdressing clips. So I'm getting my weave in in three days. So these are needed for when I'm curling my hair because there's just going to be so much hair. So I needed these to separate it. And then I picked up a microwave plate. Pretty boring, I know, but does what it says on the tin microwave plate. Then I picked up a two pack of car air fresheners. Just going to give one to Jimmy and one to me. Um, I really need to clean my car, so I hate doing it, like it's disgusting at the minute, but I need, I'm going to clean it and then put a new air freshener in it, because there's no point in putting nice air freshener in it, and it's bogging. I picked up some skips, love them. Then I got a uh, money box, these are absolutely great for like all your like spur change and just saving stuff, so it's like a wee nude with like pink leopard print, just pretty then i just picked up some razors this one is just a razor and then it has an extra two heads in it so that's the job then i got some of this sure bright bouquet deodorant this is actually i think this was 150 i'm pretty sure then i picked up this hairspray so usually i stick with the same hairspray but this is the fern mccann extra firm holds hairspray and it's like but this is the firm That dog of mine is wild. Okay, so like I was saying, this is the Fern McCann Extra Hold Hairspray in a really nice pink bottle. They also had a normal Firm Hold one, but I thought I'd pick the Extra Firm Hold one up just so that it holds my curves a bit better. But yeah, thought I would try this. Then I picked up this wee dish. Now this is actually meant to be like a tea light holder. It was only 50p, um, but it's like grey on this half and then white with like rose gold spots on this half. And I thought this would be really nice to have like we soap like a wee soap pump sitting on if you know what I mean um but yeah I suppose you could use this for all different things just to like keep your rings on or something like that then I picked up some Milky Bar mix-ups actually seen Freya Frankton say in her parent haul how much she loves these and I've actually never tried them so shout out to her um yeah can't wait to try them also picked up some smarties um haven't had these in years and seen them at the till and was like mm, need them. so you get four tubes in that little pouring and i picked up this big bag of dog biscuits like i've said before like i go through these so quickly because i have three dogs so they love a wee bit they hear me saying biscuit oh <laughs> um they love a wee biscuit so can't beat these for a pound they used to do the um is it pedigree ones I used to get like the box of them in Poundland but they don't do them anymore so I just get that bag they're pretty much the same then I picked up the Biscoff 
with the chocolate on them so I haven't tried these yet I haven't been able to get my hands on them so cannot wait a big fan of this stuff and then lastly is my egg tag fave from Poundland these mini chocolate croissants these are so good um you can't eat them cold but I actually stick them in the microwave for like 30 seconds and unreal get them every time I go um so if you haven't tried these definitely try them they're so yummy I'm pretty sure they do big versions as well but I like the mini versions but yeah, that's everything I got. Didn't think it was interesting enough to make a food video on it, so I just thought I would include it in this and show you what I got. So yeah, I'm actually going to try one anyway. Because I'm absolutely starving. So I just don't know what to expect from them. Okay. It's weird. Like, are they both different? Oh my god. <gasps> Game changer. Let me try the other one. Mm. Shout out to Freya. Love them. So I've just finished filming my Miss Pop haul and my Primark haul, and I'm just feeling very deflated. Like, I don't feel like they are very good. Like, you'll probably have already seen the Miss Pop haul because it's getting uploaded on Wednesday. Um, I don't know. I just, I just feel like, I don't know. I feel like everything I was showing was rubbish, but it wasn't, do you know what I mean? Like, boring stuff, like, I feel like, like, do you, please let me know. Like, do you like seeing, like, casual bits that you can wear every day? Do you know what I mean? Or, like, this is one of the stuff from the Primark haul, which is, like, a sweatshirt. Like, do you like seeing stuff like that? Or do you like seeing, like, dressy stuff? Do you know, like, blazers and dresses and things like that? Because I just feel like when I'm showing, like basic like loungewear and joggers and sweaters and like plain t-shirts like it's just boring like what do you think like personally like when I watch hauls like I'm not gonna buy like fancy going out dresses or things like that so it really defeats the purpose like I'm more likely to go and buy something that someone's shown if it's like something I can wear a few times or I really like it or it's comfy or something like that so please please let me know because I just feel like I'm being I'm being a bit hard on myself I feel like I don't know it just feels like it's, it's a bit boring showing loungewear and jumpers and stuff but it's what I wear so please let me know if you like it because I'm just feeling a bit rubbish about it to be honest so yeah that's how I'm feeling today but yeah I'm just lying here on my filming chair, waiting on Jamie getting home because we're eating a Chinese tonight. Um, yeah, just feeling a bit. I've had a bit of a shitty week to be honest, so I think I'm just being like pretty hard on myself because usually I really enjoy like filming hauls and just like showing you what stuff I buy, whether it be rubbish or not. But like, I'm just feeling like I don't know, I'm just feeling very strange. So maybe I'm just being maybe I'm just being silly. Let me know if I'm being silly, please. Thanks. Good morning everyone. Well, actually I have a cheek to say good morning. It's like one o'clock, but we've literally just got up and got ready. We're in bed all morning and we're just gonna go to McDonald's and get some food and have a wee look around the shops. I put her perfume on my chest yesterday for the first time like in years and it's literally like I don't know if you can see it but it's like broke out in a really bad rush. I don't know. Well, I usually just spray it on my clothes you see but yesterday I was wearing like a top like this and I just like spritzed it on my chest and obviously my skin is too sensitive for that so that's pretty annoying so my chest looks like pretty ugly so yeah but I'm absolutely starving so I cannot wait to get a McDonald's just have her scrape back today and literally put a bit of concealer, bronzer, eyebrow gel, mascara and lip balm on a wee bit of highlighter not too much coverage, just felt like I looked a wee bit dead this morning, so had a bit something on. Um, but yeah, gonna go get a fed. Why do McDonald's get your order wrong every single time? Like, no hate. I used to work at McDonald's, so know how it is, but every single time we go, there seemed to be something wrong. Jamie's feeling. <laughs> So I'm literally just going through all my clothes um, that I'm selling. So if you didn't know, I have an Instagram page that I sell my 
old clothes on rather than using Depop so I'll leave the link down in the description box for it but I've literally got like excuse the fact that my bed is currently needing made but I've literally got like a basket full and then all these on the bed and then another bag full I just don't know how I'm getting through them like I'm trying to take pictures of them and post them as I go but I'm drained already so I might have to give up for now <laughs> but I've posted a good lot so hopefully it's just trying to get nice pictures of them because like it's so hard to get pictures that actually do them justice if you know what I mean so yeah go have we know that everything's kind of ranged from size 6 to 10 so if you're that's UK size so if you're a size UK 6, 8 or 10 then there'll be some nicey bits and they're really cheap as well and if you buy three or more items then you get free delivery so yeah check it out well happy Monday everyone I am just chilling out you okay? I'm just chilling out on the sofa I've literally basically like I don't know, like I feel like I've been really busy today but I've also done nothing. Do you get what I mean? Like I had um an uh, important appointment this morning with my accountant and then what did I do? I went to the bank and the post office and stuff. Oh, oh my stomach, my stomach. And the post office and stuff. Um <laughs> don't and yeah. That was about it. But I just feel like I haven't stopped. It's now half four. I'm literally just sitting waiting to go get my extensions in. And I'm so, so, so excited. Like, I cannot wait to feel like an absolute queen once I have them done. Because this is just not doing it for me. But I've just, like, I'm sitting watching a bit of YouTube. And I've just came across Kelly Stamps for the first time. And I'm literally wetting myself. Like, she's so funny. This is her channel here. It's actually so funny. I'm just watching the My Day as a full time YouTuber, taxes, writing, and editing. But yeah, like I've just came across it and it's literally like one minute in and I was not myself already, especially like when you go onto her channel, there's like a wee um, intro video like all about her and I was like, gig, love it. So yeah, definitely will be subscribing to her. I can't believe I've never, she's 375,000 subscribers. I can't believe I've never um, heard of her before. But yeah, YouTube for you. It's time. It is literally so pretty in here. Like, it's just a wee cabin, but look at the wee photo area. It's just so nice, isn't it? So excited. Okay, so I've literally just got in and it's like half eleven so I'm so tired so I'm gonna make this really quick but look at this how nice is this it's so hard to show um I will turn around onto the mirror and show you like look at the length of this I think I got 20 inch I can, I can barely speak right now I'm so tired but um yeah just love my whole life. Whip and Mare. Colleen is so good and her hair is like such good quality. Like, look at them curls. I love that. Also, she's also just came out with little combs and brushes and like, can, like conditioning sprays and like leave-in masks and stuff. So she's given me this wee comb. Um, it's a rose gold kind of comb and it doesn't split the curl so like look at that like it makes your curls so nice oh, love it look at that I think I'm actually gonna film so obviously I've had this weave before this isn't my first time getting a weave with Colleen and I absolutely love it, like the hair is amazing. So I think I'm gonna film a tutorial on how I style it. Rocco! Um, I'm gonna film a tutorial on how I style my wave because when I had it before, I always got so many questions on how I made it look the way I did because it kind of looked like a bouncy blow dry. But yeah, absolutely love it. Last time I only got 16 inch and this is 20 inch. So it is a good bit longer, but like, who is she? Absolutely love it. I literally feel like Rapunzel right now.
I'm just gonna go and end the vlog here because I'm super tired and I'm gonna stick a pizza in the oven because I haven't had dinner and it's like half eleven and I have work in the morning. But yeah, good night everybody.